So this is a quick introduction of the Casio Class Wiz. You will notice that it is a high resolution LCD screen. So we have icons. You can click down and see what icons are available. Let me tell you what they are. Your calculate, complex calculations, base n calculations, matrix calculations, vectors, statistics, distributions, spreadsheets for the first time, tables, equations and functions, inequalities, and ratios. So let's take a quick look at uh, our very first option. We could either highlight the option or press the number one to enter that option. Here we're in our current menu uh, in this calculator, class whiz. You've got natural display. You also have the ability to simplify square roots or a combination of simplified square roots and fractions. Uh, very forgiving as well. 2 plus, I want to make that negative 3, so we'll edit that. I'm using the minus key, you could also use the negative. With a high resolution screen, you can actually tell the difference between the two, but calculator does know the difference. Notice the, uh, the difference between the two. You can see how it is because of the high resolution screen, it's much easier to see. Other features, um, complex calculations. Let's look at uh, statistics. You can choose what kind of statistics you want to do. We're going to do some two variable statistics. Put a couple of numbers in column A, which is your X, and we'll put a few in for B. You also have a frequency column that comes up. Uh, you can toggle that on or off. Go into your options. We can calculate the regression. This calculator also has the ability to create QR codes. So when you click QR code, you get a QR code. When you scan that with this smart device, a computer or some kind of a smart device or a tablet, you get yourself a QR code, you scan that, or in this case we'll click it, it will open up a window that will give you a graphical representation which includes regression ability to draw curve regressions on here, as well as the actual data that we were looking at, so that you'll see that your data matches exactly what's on your calculator screen and you get a regression equation a regression line. You also get the scatter plot. You can calculate the regression on your calculator. So it bridges the gap between a graphing calculator and a non-graphing calculator. Some of the unique features include distributions as well as the ability to do spreadsheets. Um, these work just like regular spreadsheets where we'll have different cell values and you can actually edit cells, fill values, calculate, recalculate, cut and paste, grab, dollar sign, so it is a full functioning spreadsheet. The ability to operate with ratios. This is a non-computer algebra system, but it will help you calculate. The ability to solve equations numerically and inequalities as well. A second degree polynomial. You have your choices there. We'll choose one. And there's your solution. Other, you can also create tables, operate with vectors, Again, you have the ability to do QR codes at different places. If we go into distributions and we want to look at a normal cumulative distribution with a lower limit of negative 1 and an upper limit of 1, standard deviation of 2, and we'll stay at a mean of 0. Gives you the probability, but again, if you click QR code and look at the QR code, QR code will give you 
graphical representation of that p-value which we looked at earlier. So there's your p-value and here's a graphical res representation of that information. There's lots of different ways you can use QR codes and lots of great functionality that are unique to a scientific calculator. That's a quick intro. If there's any videos you'd like to see, contact your Casio rep. This is the Casio ClassWiz.